Hello, in this video I'm going to talk about foreign eye diagrams, specifically about the largest empty circle, which is also called the toxic waste dump problem. As shown here in the syllabus, the formula for the distance between two points is given on page 2 of your forming book. The point on a Voronoi diagram, that is, as far as possible from any of the sites, is the centre of the largest circle that can be drawn that does not contain any of the sites. This circle is referred to as the largest empty circle, as shown here in the diagram. The largest empty circle problem is also called the toxic waste dump problem, because one application might be to find where waste can be deposited so that it is as far as possible from habitation. Within the boundaries of a Voronoi diagram, the centre of the largest empty circle will either be at the boundary of the diagram or at a vertex. In the IB examination, the centre of the largest empty circle will always be at a vertex, as shown here in this diagram. To identify the largest empty circle, for each vertex, calculate the distance to the sites in the neighbouring cells. So for the top vertex, calculate the distance to sites B, C or D, as shown. For the middle vertex, calculate the distance to site B, D or E. And for the bottom vertex, calculate the distance to sites A, B or E. You only need to calculate one distance for each vertex, as the vertex is equidistant from all its neighbouring sites. And then select the vertex that has the greatest distance. In the example shown, the Voronoi diagram has five sites A, B, C, D and E. Circles are drawn around each of the three vertices so that there are no sites within any of the circles. And since the orange circle is the largest of the three, so the vertex marked in red is the furthest distance from any of the sites. In this question, you're asked to find the largest empty circle for the sites given. If we start by locating and identifying the vertices, there are vertices at the point 0, 0,2 and at 1,0. As shown, and I will refer to them as x and y. Using the distance formula, which is given on page 2 of your formula booklet, calculate the distance from vertex x to one of its neighbouring sites, a, b or c. I have chosen to use site c. Substituting the values into the formula, and then calculating the result. So on the calculator, I'll press shift to access square root, put a bracket around 2 minus 0 squared, plus and another bracket around 3 minus 2 squared, pressing execute to calculate the result, which is equal to root 5 units. So that is the radius of the circle centred at x, passing through sites A, B and C, as shown. Moving on to vertex y, again using the distance formula to calculate the distance to any of its neighbouring sites, A, C or D. Again, I've chosen to use site C. Substituting the values into the formula, and calculating the result. So again on the calculator, square root of 2 minus 1 squared plus and in brackets 3 minus 0 squared. Given the square root of 10 units and that's the radius of the circle centred at vertex Y passing through the sites A, C, D, 
as can be seen on the diagram. As YC is greater than XC, the largest empty circle has a centre at 1,0 and a radius equal to root 10 units. In this question, we're asked to find the coordinates of the required location of the toxic waste dump so that it is as far as possible from any town. If we start by locating and identifying the vertices. The diagram has two vertices, one at 1,8, the other at 16,8. I will refer to them as X and Y. Using the distance formula to calculate the distance from vertex X on one of its, to one of its neighbouring sites, A, E or F. I've used site A. And performing the calculation, that's the square root of 0 minus 1 squared plus 0 minus 8 squared. And giving a decimal answer by pressing the decimal button. XA is equal to 8.06 units, correct to three significant figures. That's the length of the radius of a circle centred at X passing through sites A, E and F, as shown. Moving on to vertex Y, and using the distance formula to calculate calculate the distance from Y to any of its neighbouring sites, B, C, E, or F. I have chosen to use site B. Substituting the values into the formula and calculating the result. Again, the square root of 20 minus 16 squared plus 0 minus 8 squared. And again, pressing the decimal button. Given a length of 8.94 units, correct to three significant figures. That's the radius of a circle centred at Y, passing through sites B, C, E and F, as shown. And as YB is greater than XA, the required location for the toxic waste dump is the point 16,8.